welcome you back to the WordPress basics videos. Now, in this video, what I want to do is I want to show you how you can use different categories. Using different categories can really help with SEO purposes, and it can really help you if you plan on building a big blog, separate things out into easy to navigate and easy for people to understand what you know everything on your site is about. So what we're going to do is we're going to just go over to posts. We'll click on posts and then from there we'll click on categories. Now what we're going to do here is we're going to name new categories. So this first category I'm going to name weight loss tips. The slug is going to be a URL that is friendly, a URL friendly version of the name. It's usually all lowercase and contains only letters, numbers, and hyphens. That's going to do that for me automatically. The description, what I like to do, most themes don't use the description, but I'm going to just put in a description and I'm going to click on add new category. So you can see now we've got weight loss tips and uncategorized. And then what this basically means though, when I go back to my posts, like right now I only have a couple of posts, but these posts were uncategorized. Okay. And what I can do is I can go ahead now and change that to weight loss tips. Okay. And update. And now, instead of being an, an uncategorized, it's now in weight loss tips. Okay. Using categories is definitely, it's a great way to streamline the navigation on your site. You know, what you can do is with the widgets, you can have widgets show different categories. Like if we wanted to add our categories onto the right, you can see now when we refresh this page, like uncategorized is a dumb, you know, for the most part anyway, it's a dumb category name. So what we're going to do is we're going to just edit this real quick. update this and now you can see when we refresh this you know for the categories we've got weight loss secrets and weight loss tips and you can see it's mainly done for search engine optimization purposes um, and then to streamline streamline your site so that you know it's just very easy to navigate all right I will see you in the next video